going on ladies and gentlemen Schman overtime here coming here to remind you don't forget hit that subscribe button once we hit 3,000 subscribers one of you lucky followers and subscribers we get to win this PSC NXT 33 Evo setup ready to go all right ship to your door all you got to do is subscribe outdoors overtime a little red button down there hit that bing. hit the bell hit the Instagram follow me Corey a underscore MMA and then go ahead to PSC Bowls and follow them as well right there those three simple steps you're automatically entered to win this bow free of charge once you do that I'm gonna hit you up when we do the drawing and whoever wins this this bow become the in-house all right guys with that being said time to get into this next episode you guys already seen me build the studio for recording product reviews, my wife's podcast, doing intros and whatever it is we're doing, taking pictures for thumbnails and everything with the white backdrop. Now, you guys have already seen a bunch of episodes down here in the bow shop. You already seen it's pretty cluttered. You know, it's hard for me to keep it organized with the family and training and everything. It takes time to stay on top of this. So, what I did, I seen a couple of videos and some construction videos and things going on mentioning different ob objects like pegboards, cork boards, and different things like that to help organize. So I came up with the idea, we're gonna revamp this shop. You know, We're gonna leave most of the equipment where it is, but we're just gonna make it where it's a lot easier to work around on the table and keep things organized. So, went to Lowe's today, picked up a few things. One thing, got another extension cord. That's just to hook up behind the table so we don't have to keep unplugging one thing to plug another thing in. Um, got these hooks right here. Going to use these to organize the bows along the wall. Um, went and picked up some cork board. Already cut it. So what I'm going to do is put one sheet here and the other sheet over here. And I got all the little hooks and hangers to help organize things. My tools, the wrenches and everything. So I got the wrenches and everything here. Allen wrenches, all my stabilizers and everything. I can set them up there. And then this thing right here got me a new little shelf box. Crafting multi-use cabinet with drawers. So that's going to replace this thing here. So I don't have to keep opening one side, close it, get to the other side. It's going to organize everything through there. got 30 apartments that's more than enough and uh yeah should chuck right here where this is cover that area and still have the rest of the table to work or i can even slide it down that way whichever way we figure it out which way we're gonna put it <clears throat> when we get to work then um one other thing i didn't get i mean i got it here already just got to put it together got some plywood and some two by fours i'm gonna go ahead and build a little arrow organizer to organize all these arrows. I'm not sure if I'm gonna organize them across here or along the side, probably right here. That was pretty easy to pull them up and cut them. But uh, this is definitely not gonna be finished today because I don't have that built. And uh, it's already pretty late. But we're gonna make do with what we got. And we're gonna get as much as we can done tonight before I head up and get some rest because I got two practices tomorrow. And then um, Thursday, we're off to Texas for the hog hunt with the veterans. So, all right guys, let's go ahead and get to work. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm back down here. It's been a few days. We took off last week. We went to Texas from Thursday to Sunday. We're Hill Sports Outdoors. 
which is a veteran foundation that I've done hunts with for, I've been hunting with them for three or four years. I've been playing softball with them for six years, which is actually how we met. So I took some time off, but in and out coming back, it's Wednesday now, I've been back since Sunday. But coming back in and out, I'll come in and do a few things to the project. And uh, tonight we're gonna try to wrap it up. We got a lot done, a lot of process, a lot hung and organized. But tonight we're gonna finish cleaning up all the extra little boxes, uh, finish adding on to the table and add on to the shop what we can and like I said we want to get it done tonight so I'm gonna get back to work but that hunt in the trip to Texas will be coming out soon so stay tuned for that as well make sure you hit that subscribe button hit the alert so you can see when that one drops but other than that I'm about to go ahead and get back to work what they see turn to the experts at PC Express we no I know there's not a lot of blood sign in that spot. But they're, but they're betting here. I'm pretty sure. That's a harder one. Took us a few more days than I expected, but we finally got the shop done. Now, it's time for me to give you guys a tour of what we got going on down here. Let's pause this TV and watch us some Warrior, the fighting movie, you know, typical MMA fighting movie. But, uh, so we're gonna go ahead and give you guys a tour of what all we got. So you guys seen the mess we had down here, what I used to call organized. And now you get to see what we got now. So. We're going to start over here with the bow press first. Alright, right here we got that easy green last chance archery bow press. Pretty simple. I went out and got some cork boards. Got the cork board up. So, we got my, this is my traveling bin. When I'm going on hunting trips. This is the one I put in my bag. So, I got a little bit of everything. Got some fletchings, I got, it fell out right now, but I got serving string up here, D-loop material, extra accessories for my rest, extra accessories for my peep, you know, stuff I need to set my string. Here's my serving material for when I work on the bow. D-loop material, here's some strings, now that I got everything set up. This is the next step, put uh, my red and black strings on black Betty. Right here we got my different bow holders. This is my Dremel tool, you know, just for grinding things down on my stand or whatever. Sharp edges, maneuvering things. Here's my little quiver. Keep it here until I go for a hunt. Extra drop away rest for somebody if I'm working on it, because this is the one I use. Mine is over there. Um, all my stabilizers. That's what I've been using right here to stokerize. I got, this is the eight inch. I got the 10 inch on now. And this is the eight and the 10 AAE. And I think this is the eight. Trophy Ridge, extra limbs for my PSC, evil right there. I put those on the hunting season on my camo limbs. Right now I'm all black. Extra wrestling. Got my Island Ridge set, metric and standard. Got all my drawers right here. Tips, inserts, mouth inserts, knots, more fletchings. Scale, knife, permanent remarker, bra heads, acetone, alcohol, and here are all my Bomar bottles. Lighter, another lighter over here. Thread lock, some steel putty I use. I'm just makeshifting things. My uh, fletching glue, white out, fletch stripper, another cork boy here. All organized. Here we go. My wraps. My try. My bow square. Uh, my Allen with the wrench. So it was kind of hard. I want to get it, make it easier. Excuse me. My bow scale. My extra wrist release. My extra drop weight rest. That Vapor Trail Gen 7X right there. If you ain't got them, go get them. Some epoxy an extra stripper 
a Max Clean wipes, my little screwdrivers, my D loop pliers, <clears throat> my pliers, my wire cutters, my star wrenches. This is where I mix my putty at. Remote to TV, my arrow cutter, my draw board. Made this a while ago. My arrows all organized out. So I got my first set of Eastern Access, those are 340s. My wife's arrows, my first set of Victories, Extortions, Victory Vape TKOs, Eastern Access 260 match grade, Eastern Access 300 regular grade, and the new Killer 6 is what I've been using. But I think I'm gonna do, since it's just target season right now, I'm gonna switch back these, I'm gonna do a couple total archer challenges. I got a lot more of these than these. I'd rather lose these than my hunting arrows. So, I'm not leaving your arrows killing sticks. If you're watching this, I'm still going to be using the killing sticks when it's time to kill some stuff. But right now, just for archery reasons, and I don't care about losing and breaking, we're going to go with those access. And over here, we got the bow rack. My son's PSC. The PSC Evil NXT that's given, getting given away. My wife's PSC Bandit NXT. My first PSC, the Stealth EC35 Carbon. Then my wife's first bow, which is a Cabela's, I think was made by Diamondback. So, a little target area right there. And then the paper tuner station. Gotta get it back, put it together and organized. Or I can bring it in and out from over here. But other than that, guys. That's the new organized shop. So, with that being said, you guys know what to do. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Click, 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 over and over and over. And then hit the alert bell. Go to Instagram. Follow me. And PAC. Enter your chance to win this bow. And other than that, thank you guys for tuning into this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, any questions you want to know? What it is I have here or how do I do certain things, drop a comment in the comment section below and I'll be sure to get to it. Other than that, if you like the episode, hit that thumbs up. If you aren't a fan, hit that thumbs down. But either way, please, oh, excuse me, it's like midnight right now. If anything, please, 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 please hit that subscribe button and help me reach 3,000 followers so I can give away this bow. Because the wife said I can't get another one until we get rid of one. Once I get rid of that, we probably got another one coming. And guess what? Do the giveaway. There's going to be another giveaway coming after that. So, with that being said, as always, we're going to sign out with love. Peace. Afro Grease. Peace.